I applied for five universities in UK and got selected in five of them. The main reason why I joined Skilling is because of the technical support engineer and the assistance they are providing. When I got my future opportunities, like uh, they are asking me, they didn't know about such things and all, like the like BIM field was there in the construction industry. The internship was something which Skilling offered me differently. Uh, it was something which I thought would not have been possibly done by any other organizations. My name is Krishnadas Kedas. I am from Ernalam district in Kerala. I have completed my B.Tech in Civil Engineering and M.Tech in Structural Engineering and Construction Project Management. I have been working as a Site Engineer in BPCL Cochin Refinery for about three and a half years. During this working phase, I really thought that there was not much of a growth in me, like I couldn't do more about me or contribute something to the society. I was like stuck at the same place for the entire time. While working as a site engineer in Cochin Refinery for three and a half years, I really thought that this was not my place and I shouldn't be here. And at that point of time, I decided to think out of the box, like it was a career change for me, from one field to another. It was at that point I came across Skilling. While browsing through the website, I found several courses there. Among them, the PG course in Design and Analysis of High-Rise Building was the one that attracted me. I went through the coursework and I think this one will be the right fit for me. When I am not a friend, I am not a friend. 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 I am not textbook pattern like they are covering the entire syllabus there like for example if i can say me in the autocad software there is a option called file if you open the file there are so many options they will go from one menu to another and another and another that's not a proper manner whereas in the skilling they are actually giving us a project like they will start from the scratch and it will be going on to the further and further stage to the next level so that we can understand the basic concept of how that software particular software works in that way i get to know about the better idea about the software how that works and later stage by stage depending upon my progress there was also a slight level of difficulty by the time and effort i provided to that course i was able to successfully master that one so the main difference is the structured syllabus which the skilling is providing. That's the one which is to be highlighted here. The main reason why I joined skilling is because of the technical support engineer and the assistance they are providing. For each course, they had a specialized teacher who will be guiding throughout the entire coursework. So the technical support engineer will actually conduct us twice a week. They will inquire us where we are, how is our progress with the coursework, are we stuck at anything. And if we have any doubt means we can contact them at any point of time during the working hours. And they will arrange a video conference so that we can clear the doubt at the live point of time. Now, it was something which I thought would not have been possibly done by any other organization. So this was the main factor or the main feature which I really liked about the skill link. When I spoke to Krishna Das at very first time, he feels more confident and determined in taking up the courses. He feels no hesitation whenever he has doubts or technical queries during their challenges and projects. And he never says no whenever we are providing any additional challenges and projects during the coursework apart from the regular challenges. Through my master's program in skilling, I learned about four to five tools in civil engineering industry. Among the tools I found most interesting was the Rivet software. Being myself a structural engineering, Rivet also contained a structural part. That was the part which I liked the most. And it was also like a workflow. We can work in the architecture, from there we can convert it into structure and then into MPP. All the processes which are required comes under the single software. So I thought this one will be the right fit for me. It was at that point of time I learned about the BIM industry. So BIM industry is something big. So if I can get the sufficient knowledge, I believe that I will be able to contribute much more into the society. Then at that point UK came into my mind. 
when i looked they have a structured course work they were giving courses related to bim field in several universities among that i applied for five universities in uk and got selected in five of them and in that i decided to go with the queens university belfast in northern ireland during his course work we came to know that krishnadas has very keen interest in bim domain so in order to develop his new skill uh, we provide more number of challenges and projects and also we have provided customized internship program now he got an opportunity to study bim and project management in one of the topmost university in the world that is queens university belfast filling la cherna padichathu kondana revit software ne kurichu kodudal arivan kaynada adile bim field avan ishtapettu adu ay videsha padanathina avan aagraham pravartichu സ്കില്ലിങ് ചേർന്നത് കൊണ്ടാണ് ബിം ഫീൽഡിനെ കുറിച്ച് കൂടുതൽ അറിയുവാനും ആ ഒരു കോഴ്സ് തിരഞ്ഞെടുക്കുവാനും സാധിച്ചത് അത് സ്കില്ലിങ്ങൽ വിവരം അറിയിച്ചപ്പോൾ അവർ അതിനനുയോജ്യമായ രീതിയിൽ അവൻ്റെ ഇൻറ്റേൺഷിപ്പ് ക്രമപ്പെടുത്തി കൊടുത്തു അപ്പോൾ ഈ കോഴ്സ് ബിം ഫീൽഡ് തിരഞ്ഞെടുത്ത് യു കെയിൽ പോകുവാൻ ഒരു നിമിത്തമായത് സ്കില്ലിങ്ങൽ ചേർന്ന് പഠിച്ചതാണ് അതിന് പ്രത്യേകം നന്ദിയുണ്ട് while uh, applying to uk i have to write a letter saying why i have decided to take this course so being myself as a structural engineer and the experiences which i had didn't matter to the mass this was entirely a different field in the letter which i wrote i had to write about the internship part mainly the internship was something which skilling offered me differently it was a structured program but i recommended to the skilling that i would be doing my masters relating to bim field in the uk so they customized it for me in such a way that i will not have to learn something new there in the university all the basic part all the things which are needed as the base level have been provided to me through the internship and i added my internship certificate as well as the statement from the skilling saying that i have did an internship program for the rivet course and it will help him in the future i think that might be the main reason why i got selected to all five of them skilling chernana shesham nalla maatam undayirunnu and kudal samayam computer undu munbil software padikkunnathinu vendi irikkarunde അതുപോലെ എന്തെങ്കിലും ഡൗട്ട്സ് ഉണ്ടെങ്കിൽ സ്കില്ലിങ്ങിൽ ടെക്നിക്കൽ സപ്പോർട്ടുമായിട്ട് വിളിച്ച് ചോദിക്കുകയും കോൺഫറൻസിൽ പങ്കെടുക്കുകയും എല്ലാ കോൺഫറൻസുകളിലും കൃത്യമായി പങ്കെടുക്കാറുണ്ട് നല്ല ഒരു ആറ്റിറ്റ്യൂഡ് ആയിരുന്നു to be honest when i joined for the skilling course the pricing was not that high but i didn't consider that at all but i was feeling motivated and i was confident that this will be the right option after learning the course it proved me right when i got my future opportunities like uh, they are asking me they didn't knew about such things and all like lay like bim field was there in the construction industry they came to know through me only and one more thing which i have to mention is that the college which i studied was actually a fresh college and we were the first batch we didn't have any help of seniors to advise us you can follow this passion civil has this many fields so this way you can do that we didn't have nobody to advise us so only the people who thought other ways went outside the circle and looked at this options and i am really happy that i made the jump from that perspective and came into this i was in a fan of using the linkedin page so uh, after completing my course the career success team came into place and i had a talk with robin jabakuma he was my career success mentor he was the one who guided me on how to use the linkedin page so i was basically a kid on i don't know what linkedin platform was but with through his guidance i was able to build a strong portfolio where other headhunters will look for us so i was able to develop a good portfolio there and with the software skills definitely i had a confidence that benefit from the linkedin page also and i started applying for all the opportunities which i got I have applied for five universities in UK and got admitted in all five of them. So uh, I think I had a good uh, resume or a good professional path behind me. And um, from that point of view, if I completed the course, I will definitely become a BIM structural engineer. That's what I have in my mind. And to gain a few certain number of years of experience and my plan will is to come back to India and start a company of my own. unique practical and an engineer's best guide